I, I can go ahead and do an introduction. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Am I doing the whole thing? Are we splitting it or how are we doing this? I mean, if you can do the whole thing or if you want to split it up with Alex, I'll say you can do one. Boom, you guys can do whatever. I'm going to throw in some questions if you want. So for those of you that don't know me, my name is Kyle DiGennaro. I'm an agent with Security Pacific Real Estate, and I also sit on the Young Professionals Networking Committee. Today what we're gonna do is, is we're gonna kinda go over a couple questions and answers that we're gonna have our panelists here answer. A little bit about me as I am busy, busy. I have two young boys, a two-year-old and a three-year-old. And when I'm not with them, I'm doing real estate. I've been in the business since 1989. I've been with Keller Williams Realty for 17 years. And I have a team, so I spend a lot of time on vacation. <laughs> <laughs> I'm Paddy Kiel, I'm with uh, Remax Accord in Lafayette and started in real estate six years ago. That's it for me. He needs a cocktail, more. <laughs> <laughs> My name is Wendy Moore. I'm with Alon Pinnell Realtors. Uh, I've been in the business 14 years, married 27 years. I have two sons, 26 years old and 24 years old. I have a team as well, so I don't get to vacation as much as Linda. I manage that team. And uh, for fun, I love driving race cars. Uh, what do you do to generate leads? I do generation is through only business by referral. So I spend a lot of time writing handwritten note cards, mailing those out to clients, making calls to past clients only. I don't do any Zillow, no Trulia. So I'm also part of a BNI networking group. Um, I do get on the phone, I do door knock. Um, I door knock around 100 doors around every listing that I take. Uh, when I moved here first, like Linda, I didn't have any friends, family, sphere of influence, the traditional methods of, of farming, so I... Um, I'm sorry, can you speak a lot louder? I'll try. Uh, so, really all I did for, for work in the first year was open houses. And uh, I found that to be the best use of time, best use of money. Uh, Zillow, I found to be a waste of time. And, and hyper-focus, like if you live in Walnut Creek, don't be the contra costa specialist, be the Walnut Creek specialist, or just be the Northgate specialist. I mean, if you nail Northgate, you'll have more money than God, it won't matter. It's an actual technique that works very well, and we're doing them year after year, and it just gets a lot of results. Uh, this that that says for Linda. Yeah. Okay, Linda. Linda, yeah. Daddy, yeah. Roxanne, maybe. Uh, like a percentage of something, at least. You don't care how much money you have for the kitchen table. I, I didn't really think about how young I was, but now looking back, I was like, gosh, I must have really ticked off a few people. <laughs> With getting successful so quickly. Everyone that I have met, we're all here for the same thing, and that's to help each other succeed. And I and I have never met a community as like we have that that share, shares that and wants everyone to succeed. It's, it's really great to be a part of, of what we're a part of. I was a senior at Ignatia Valley High School. I'd ride my bike to Sherry Circle, for those of you that know where the um, area is. And I would sit there for three hours, for $3.50 an hour, and I would type. And so ask me any zip code in Contra Costa County. So that's how I was introduced to the industry through the MLS book. So I feel like a lot of the questions that we've had have been, we probably go for the two of you um, more so, and I'm sure you folks have something to add. Um, do you have a buyer presentation package? I know there's listing packets, things like that. Do you have a certain setup that you go through with each one of your buyers to kind of prepare them? Or do you just kind of sit down and take it as it comes? I am a lender. I'm also on the CCAR Board of Directors as your affiliate director. So anytime you have any concerns or questions or needs, please reach out. If you have any questions, let me know. We just do a lot of stuff. We're here for you. We close in 21 days if need be. And thank you all for coming. Yeah. 
The event went well. Um, we had five panelists for listing buyer agents, giving tips and uh, details for new agents, experienced agents too. It went well. I mean, we had like 35, 40 people show up. We had a few sponsors networking afterwards and really good feedback. I mean, this type of event, like listing buyer agent panels where they get to share their experience, I mean, it's pretty impressive. A few other people, um, or actually one other person built a pretty large team. She has six people under her and that was also pretty impressive to hear. So a lot of diversity on the panel, very good information. And I think if you really listen to what they did, they gave so much good solid information that I think you can take your business to a whole new level. It's a good event. Oh,